Hey, welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and um, we're going to talk a little bit about a feature in Windows 8.1 called Switcher. In Windows 8 we had a thing called Snap and you could snap apps together and basically nobody used it because it was dreadfully difficult to use. It had almost a mind of its own and trying to snap apps together was horrible. Now, they've made things a little better in Windows 8.1 and um, they actually added a feature called Switcher. Switcher will help you snap apps easily. All you need to do is actually run several apps. So for example, here I have three apps running, the desktop app, news and weather. Let's say that I wanted to switch and have snapped apps on my screen. First of all, you open one app. Let's say that I'll open my weather app. So I'll click the weather app. Now every app that you open is on the left side in the app bar. So if you go into the corners or if you have a touch device, you can swipe on the left side of your screen um, and you'll see that the app bar is there. And if you right click on apps in that bar, you see that you have insert left, right. You also have replace weather. So you can play with that. So for example, I've clicked the news app, I'll insert it right. And you see now it's really snapped here. And the snap allows me to see two apps together. And you can of course customize the app snapping by just moving around like this. So you can uh, give more real estate to one than the other. Um, and this Integration works depending on the, the, the size of your screen. For example, I have a small laptop screen here, so it doesn't give me a lot of choices. But if you have lots of real estate, so if you have a big, uh, let's say a 27 inch screen, you'll have a lot more apps that you can actually snap here. You want to change one of those apps, let's say that instead of the uh, weather app, I want to keep the news app open so let's say that I click on a um, little news item here and I want to have the desktop on the left well I'll go to my open apps bar right click on the desktop and say okay I want to replace weather and here goes my weather is now replaced with the desktop app and here I can run stuff so let's say that I open Microsoft Word is going to open there. So uh, keep in mind that what's a program that usually runs on the desktop is what will be called the desktop at this point. And so any app that you want to use, you'll be able to open like this. All you need to do is let them run and then from the uh, you know app bar on the left side of your screen, you'll be able to switch. So if I right click here and I say, well, I want to replace news. Here it goes. Weather is here, news here, and of course, like I said, you can customize. Now, what's cool is that if you have, like I said, big screen real estate, so more than 20 inches, you'll have the possibility to snap four, five apps on the screen. If you have a small screen, like here it is a 15-inch laptop screen, it actually lets me snap two apps because it knows that if I snap three, it's going to be too small. It's not worth it. So uh, that's a thing called switcher. And you know, all you have to do is just remove, move the, the uh, little bar that separates the apps totally to the left or the right to go back into a full screen app and, uh, you know, use it as usual. So that's called Switcher. It's a useful feature if you want to actually, um, you know, go through different apps and have them on your screen at the same time. It's often, you know, useful if you're, for example, if you write an article and you need reference, you can leave open um, a news article or a text in one window and snapped together you'll have a word processor for example so you'll be able to check out uh, details of what you're writing if you need information and so on 
If you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe to our channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions on what you've seen, let us know. Maybe you have an app, maybe you have a feature of Windows that you'd like us to make a video. Let us know also by subscribing. You will know when we put videos online. We try to put them video videos every week. And hopefully you enjoy our videos and we'll come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Bye-bye.